Okay, here we have the two quartz rocks that I brought back with me from that area of that uh, wall that was built. I posted in another post. We can tell I've tuned up my Falcon MD-20 and you can tell there's uh, some uh, interesting activity underneath this uh, dirt. That's uh, indicating that it's a uh, metal, a non-ferrous metal, because as I put the wand to the rock, I get the signal. See that little piece of gold there in the middle? My MD-20 sounds off going to it. That is a non-ferrous metal. Here, you see the black sand. And it sounds off as I pull it away. So that's going to determine what kind of uh, situation we got here underneath this dirt. To it, non-ferrous metal. Here's the other one that you saw in the video of this smaller rock that I picked up. And as you can see, it's a very nice color. The um, quartz in this one is tinted from added minerals. Uh, it's not the white bull quartz that you would find in many locations, but a nice deep color. On this rock, we have some dirt. Let's get it up here a little closer. Let's check this out. I have some uh, very good possibilities here that we have gold in the dirt. Probably not in the rocks. I would rather the gold be in the dirt because it's easier to pan dirt than it is to crush rocks. Let's take them and drop them into the water. And let's uh, soak them for about an hour. And I've already noticed that some of the dirt is coming off of it. Maybe we won't have to soak them. 